What's up, you guys? Marty Schwartz here with Marty Music. We're going to break down Led Zeppelin's rock and roll iconic song by an iconic guitar player on an iconic guitar. Gibson Guitars was kind enough to let me use this beautiful brand new 50 style Les Paul standard. And I mean, if you're going to play some Jimmy Page stuff, this is the one. So anyway, check the link below if you want to learn more about it. Let's get rocking. All right, very bluesy kind of uh, riffage here. We're gonna do an A power chord. So open A, second fret D, and then we're gonna hammer up to the fourth fret of the A string. And you definitely wanna be strumming the A and D the, the whole time of the riff. And so I'm going, and then it comes off. And then I'm grabbing that fifth fret D. Then it comes off. That's all planted there. So then I'm grabbing the fourth fret after the fifth fret. But this time, immediately from that fourth fret D, my middle finger is going to grab that third fret a, and then I'm going to bend it. And it's not quite even a half step, I don't think. You know, you're, you're really giving it that, that character. So you pull that off, still once again, basing it on that A power chord, and then you're gonna do that classic, which is just adding your ring finger up to the fourth fret of the D string. So you put it all together. One more time really slow. So just, just keep an eye out for that four to three doesn't have an open chord in between where the other ones do. Now the good news is if, we, if you get that riff, all you do is you just scoot it over to the open D and G. Nothing new, you just scoot it down one string. Back to the A. And on the intro, you scoot it up a string for the E. Nothing new, the exact same thing. Back to the A. Now with your uh, index finger still on that A power chord, now we're gonna do some classic Zeppelin uh, Jimmy Page stuff that's in tons of Zeppelin riffs. You got the A power chord and then you've got that third fret of the E. So we go like this. So we hit that third fret E, and then the A power chord. Again. Again. And then a little variation. One 
once again, just it's like a blues. So once you do that, you just scoot it over again. So you've got index on the second fret G, open D, and then middle finger on the third fret of the A. Then you have a turnaround, and this time it goes up into this little kind of Chuck Berry kind of vibe where you're playing an E power chord up here on the 7th fret A string, 9th fret D, and then Pinky's going up a whole step to the 11th fret. A little slower. And then we just do a quick hit on the D power chord which is, you know, 5th fret A, 7th fret uh, D, so. Alone, 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 time. One. So just another little tip, you know, that if you're counting one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, the riff actually is right after one. So it's like one, two, three, four, one. One. And so, you know, you can do classic, you know, blues playing as a solo, you know, major pentatonic and minor pentatonic mixed together, lots of minor pentatonic. Um, but then there's just that classic riff and it's doubled. There's so many overdubs with Jimmy Page, but this great lick, just to know, it's minor pentatonic, A minor pentatonic, and you're just doing a hammer on pull off uh, between that five and eight of the B string. And then you're grabbing the seven of the G. It's all from the pentatonic. Just like that kind of thing. And Jimmy Page, you know, he's got, oh, he's just so awesome but he's always got a little bit of that like grease when he's playing. They're never like per perfectly clean licks. They're always got a little, a little sloppiness in a cool way, you know? But if you don't know that lick already, you can throw that into the mix as well and, you know, have some fun with it. Right there was, I hope you had as much fun as I did playing it. Also, thank you again to Gibson Guitars for uh, letting me use this super badass Les Paul, a la Jimmy Page. So if you want to learn more about this awesome Les Paul, and including other killer Gibsons, don't forget to click that link below. Thanks again. We'll see you real soon.